A direct flight from London to Lagos takes only around six and a half hours. However, for Pelumi Nubi, this journey will be an extraordinary two-month solo road trip by car. This Peugeot 107 has been customized for her journeys, featuring provisions for sleeping and dining. So when you open up the back bit, this has been replaced with a plank of wood and you have the tap area which also is connected to like a water tank so I can do like my washing up, you know, cooking happens here. I have a gas um, cooker right there and then we have the sleeping area on this side. Preparations for the extensive expedition across Europe to West Africa have been meticulous with safety being a top priority. I have done about a year preparation for this trip, um, whereby I've been able to speak to other people that have done similar trips. I've been able to kind of like, you know, a lot of in-depth research to see what are the policies like, how I'm able to cross, cost of it, um, the safest route. Again, I'm doing this solo, so I just have to make sure I'm, you know, quite responsible in that way. Mentally, it's just kind of hyping myself, like really. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like frightened, but most days I'm just like, this is doable, this is possible. Um, and really that's the message I want to convey. The 29-year-old Globetrotter has already explored over 80 countries and undertaken several mini solo road trips, but this particular adventure stands out from the rest. This is very daring <laughs> in comparison to others. I've definitely done many, you know, trials. Um, this is longer in duration, more expensive in terms of like the cost of what it entails as a whole. And really just kind of like really daring, stepping out of my comfort zone compared to the other ones I've done in the past. I am traveling through two different continents. So that's another difference in compared to the other travels I've done previously. I mean, it's not just a drive. I really did want to experience each and every destination that I stop in. The total is about 17 countries. Um, whereby I'm able to explore the whole, um, some of the European countries, then you know, cross into Morocco and just keep making my way down west of Africa. Her aspiration is to not only showcase Africa, but also serve as an inspiration for young black girls and to motivate others to break out of their comfort zones. Honestly, I just wanted to show that this kind of travel was very possible for someone that looks like me and really inspiring the next generation of travelers that they can step out of their comfort zone and do incredible things. And one thing about traveling is that it extrapolates towards your life and you can take those lessons and use it. So I really just want to inspire um, people to get on the road, to get adventurous, to step out of their comfort zone and showcase Africa in a way that has not been done in a lot of like, you know, um, mainland media and just being able to say this is my experience. Living with dyslexia, she also aims to highlight the advantages of solo travel. Solo road trips from London to Lagos are not unheard of, but Pelumi is set to make history as the first black female to undertake this remarkable trip. From London, Tenyola Uyitayo, Channel Television.